Hello and welcome back to Minecraft. This is MC Daily. We're going into multiplayer today so I can show you Super Maze Challenge 2.0. So we're going to play some Minecraft, watch Top Gear, and get a pig. Logging in here. And if you did want to join the server, you have to be whitelisted. So leave an application at minecraft.turbowaffle.com and uh, we can whitelist you in so the link is down below in the information station so yeah this is my I was talking how I made a cobble castle this is it this is the shitty cobble castle that I made so shitty it's ah uh, fuck it's pretty ah uh, fuck it's hilarious so over there was a the demolition it's kind of hilarious because it's funny that the door is the only thing remaining over there and that video is actually on YouTube as well, but I think I might post it onto the uh, Minecrafting Daily channel instead of my personal channel. Okay, so that is my mob tower and grinder, but we're not going there today. We are going around it because the entrance to the challenge is around this thing. So. I'm going to fast forward you through me traveling. All right. And so we have arrived to Super Maze Challenge version 2.0. These are the rules and this is the entrance. I don't have that much health so let's hope I can do this in one shot. Maybe I should set a home here. Uh, let's just not and say we did. Okay. So uh, first section is 2.1 Terra Construct. It's uh, very easy, but it can be very difficult at the same time. It's just a bunch of slabs. Uh, two by two slabs here, and some stairs that go down. So let's see where am I here. Uh, shit. I went the wrong way. I should have gone this way, I think. Yeah. So we go this way. You go down. And there are one by one blocks here. Somebody broke this and cheated. Let's find out who did that. Okay, it was Cosmic. So he cheated. A piece of shit. He didn't even win the race, so it's fine. It was Nar who won. Alright. It was Nar who won again, yes, from version. One, he won, and version two, he won as well. This is section 2.2, the pit. As you can see, we have to travel up on top. If you fall down below, you can use the stairs to get back up, but there's no way out down below. Um, shit, there might be, I mean, in a natural cave system, but you'll be going the wrong way. So, oops, I uh, did that wrong. Okay, so let's get across this thing here. Uh, really? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I will be right back. Okay, I am back and I set my home to here. And let's go across. Fuck me. I actually uh, pressed it too late. Okay, here we go. No more failing, please. Okay, uh, let's see, we go this way, and we go this way, this way, and across here, done! And that's the end, you continue, so let me show you the the other view of it. So, I mean, there's lots of, there's a couple ways you can go, actually. Uh, it's just very hard when the race is on, lots of players are bumping into each other, falling down, and stuff like that, so, <laughs> missing the jumps, too, it's, uh... There was quite some fun in there. It was pretty hilarious. I have a video of the maze as well, so I'll try to compile because it's like I, I filmed about an hour of it, so I'll try to compile a short version of it and stuff like that. So this is section 2.3, Dragon's Breath, and you have to ascend. And this is very hard here. Let me go back really quick, and uh, let me set my home to this location. Okay, let's see if I can do this in one shot. 
and uh, pretty much what it is is a lava lava ladder thing going on here so as you can see it is very hard only one person passed this I think actually two people passed this lucid ondine and nar oh fuck I am on fire now shit I'm gonna have to restart I don't think I'll have enough hearts to continue I think this is the right way oh my god am I gonna burn am I gonna burn fuck that was the exit there you saw let's try this again okay I almost got stuck alright let's try this one more time F really right now Are you kidding me fuck Okay. All right. All right. All right. Okay. So we can do this carefully, and that is doing this. You use shift on the ladder, and you press the right or left key to move, and that will help you across this thing here. Very dangerous. What? How the fuck did that happen? Oh my god, that's retarded. Fuck, now I'm burning again! Ah, let's just let's try it one more time. <sighs> okay, third time's charm. Oh, I'm stuck in the wall. Hold on. I'm still stuck in the wall. Really? Really? Oh, Jesus. Fuck! Okay. I don't even have enough hearts to, like, if I were to get burned, I don't have enough hearts to not uh, get burned, or some shit like that. Like, I'll have hearts remaining, you have like two and a half hearts, okay, let's just fucking die real quick. Holy shit. Okay, I got stuck a little bit, I lost a half heart coming in there. Uh, okay, oh shit, alright fourth try here. Very hard to do. But let's just do it carefully. Good. And the next one. Alright. We're good. And the next one. Ooh, I think... Okay, we're good. Ah, fuck! Okay, let's... Let's just keep going. I hope I won't... Okay, I have two hearts left. If I catch on fire, I'm going to burn. Okay, the exit is right there. Can I do this? Straight shot up. This is crucial that I make this turn right here. And I did it. Awesome. Okay. Alright, before I forget, let me set my home. Okay, so you exit a dragon. I'll show you the dragon here in just a sec. Okay, we're set home to here. Okay, so this is section 2.4, the Corsair. So that's the dragon right there. You come out of the dragon's mouth. And it's the Corsair. It's very symmetrical. Super symmetrical. And there's a couple ways you can actually get to the top. And this is the way I got to the top here when I was making it. Um, however, it's not as symmetrical as you think. There are some blocks blocking uh, the path of symmetry. So you have to actually figure it out. It's still part of, like, it's still mazy but it's confusing as hell. Okay. And we do this. And I think we go up here. Or do we go up here? I think it's this way. Yeah, see, this is blocked here, and those two are blocked, but this one is not blocked, as you can see. But somebody put... No, no, nobody put cobble right there. Okay. And we go around real quick, like. And we go up. And we gotta go around again. almost at the top of the Corsair and we did it okay so 
We are at section 2.5, the last section, live stream. Fall onto the live stream, but be very careful. And there we go. So the live stream is just very basically a water channel system. You follow the water to the end. People who stray away from the path will get so lost. This sign says, follow the stream to the end and you will succeed. And so... Ooh, I lost a heart on that. Or a half heart. That's okay. So you follow the stream. It's really easy for now. And then come down here. And we continue to follow the stream down into this little gorge here. And you continue. Very easy to stray away from the path. But uh, it, you, you shouldn't. If you follow the signs, you should be good. You should be good to go. And then we come to this part here water flows from many paths one path leads to the surface so you have lots of water paths here but there's one that happens to go under here and there you have it this is just the end right here almost so you travel up the water here and then you finally get to a a, a bit of a cave with TNT and you blow your way out of it and it is pretty cool I died when the guy was doing it <laughs> I think I was filming at the time so I'll definitely render up a video just getting up the stream is a pain in the ass now that they changed the water who would do such a horrible thing okay I might drown nope I'm good so this is it this is the the cave here it was much smaller than this and this is the way out so somebody blew this all the way up and it actually takes so long to get up there oh yeah it takes forever so I'm just gonna fast forward it if I even can hold on here I might drown oh no I'm still good okay Oh my god, this is horrible. My mouse is really fucking me right now. So yeah, I'm going to fast forward it. Okay, and so that's it. That's the end, and this is the treasure cache. Your reward is in here, so you have to hurry. You dig in, and you open up the chests to find 15 diamonds to the victor, who was Nar once again. So that is it. That's the Super Maze Challenge version 2.0. Next up in multiplayer will most likely be my Dungeon Craft preview, and then the Dungeon Craft in play itself. So I will see you guys next time. MC Daily signing out.